Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a bit of an experimental swipe. I've been wondering for a while what if anything would happen if I stenciled an image onto a canvas and swiped over it. I'm just curious, you know, whether you'll see the raised effect under the paint or not really. So that's what we'll find out today. To get started, I'm laying down my various base colors, starting with Thalo Green. Each of these paints is mixed 4 parts paint to 8 parts Floetrol to 1 part water plus 1 drop of silicone. If you'd like to see how I mix my paints for a swipe painting, I have a video on that which I'll include in the description box. I'm just tilting the canvas a bit to spread the paint around to cover some of the open spaces. Now I'm laying down some ivory black, which is mixed four parts paint to eight parts Floetrol to three parts water. This black is a thinner consistency than the paint already on the canvas and it doesn't contain any silicone oil. Okay, now for the swipe. As I usually do, I'm using a piece of plastic that I cut out from the plastic wrapper that the canvas came in. I love it when the cells start popping up. They look so cool. Now for a quick close-up, so I love the colors and wow, look at the cells within cells within cells, that is so cool. And zooming out, I like how you can see the very subtle butterfly image or effect too. So I'm going to let this dry and then we'll see whether the stencil pattern shows up or not. Alright, so the stencil is super subtle I'd say. Definitely more subtle than what I was hoping for. <clears throat> I think a layer of gloss varnish once this had had a few weeks to dry um, might help add a bit of shine which could bring out the pattern a little bit more so I might give that a try in a few weeks. Even though it didn't work out quite as I'd hoped, I do still think it's a pretty piece. Thank you for joining me as always and I look forward to seeing you again next time.